Now, you were born in East Germany. Right, I was born in East Germany in 1975 and grew up here until the change came in 1989 and went to school here and was a 7th grader, 8th grader in 89. When the wall came down, so when the wall you, came down. that would have made you 13, 14? 13, 14, yeah. I turned 14 nine days before the wall came down. Really? So, um, what, um, what, what was the school like? You said that the school you attended was all Stasi. Um, yeah. Um, or, or the children I, of Stasi. Yeah. I was, um, I was living in this apartment building all my life and it's quite close to the headquarters of Staatssicherheit or Stasi and so most of the people living in this quarter um, have worked for the Staatssicherheit as well so in my class the uh, parents uh, of my fellow colleagues had mostly um, Staatssicherheit as their profession given them the um, book and it was only two who had not my parents and the parents of a caretaker of his house who were not on their payroll and the whole school was very politically correct and uh, tried to get um, new politicians raise new politicians for the future of the socialist state so um, we were very much indoctrinated right, yeah. Right? Oh. yeah and um, um, they took care that we had the right things in our head. Right. Well, that's basically you it. You want to perpetuate the system, so you're gonna you're gonna train younger right. people. So, but with you, it sounds like it wasn't just indoctrination. I think that's what everybody in the country got. But they were actually training. Yeah, the, future leaders the of future East leaders Germany. in this school, and but you were not. <laughs> you um, so, so that kind of gives you a unique look. Yeah, I was not really that much into it. Um, I was a pioneer, a young pioneer, and then the Tillman pioneer later on. Um, I was never old enough to turn into the FDJ, the Freie Deutsche Jugend, um, because the country just uh, deceased <laughs> beforehand. Ceased to exist. 